I uh, joined the Black Panther Party when I was 15 years old. It was a direct result of the assassination of, of Martin Luther King. When Dr. King was killed, it just radicalized a lot of us. And then I was like, no, we can't turn the other cheek, you know, we have to fight back. And it just captured not only the imagination of the black community, but it captured the attention of the world, that people would stand up in a way that was so disciplined, um, that was so strong, so powerful, and so thought out. Joseph joined the Harlem chapter and quickly rose to the ranks of leadership, known as the New York Panther 21. Uh, six months after I joined the Panthers, I was arrested. The Panther 21 were exonerated, but Joseph went back to prison on other Panther-related charges. When I got to Leavenworth Federal Prison, which is a maximum security prison, an older gentleman who was a prisoner gave me um, some life-changing advice. It was very simple, it was very wise. Um, he said, young blood, you can serve this here time, or you can let this here time serve you. So I took every course I could. I started writing poetry. I started writing plays. I formed a theater company in prison. And I started seeing the effect of the creative arts on our environment and on the men. And I decided then that I wanted to be a revolutionary artist. I wanted to combine art and activism and be an artivist. Nine years later, Joseph was released and moved to Harlem. I go back to the 90s when people were walking away from Harlem. We had kids who had no, nothing to do and no place to go. And uh, my wife and I and uh, my producing partner, Voza Rivers, decided to create a program where kids could come on Saturdays and uh, be in a safe place and learn to, um, to express themselves. The world is my backyard and the sky is no longer a limit. But Once a week, children from Harlem rest. meet at Impact I can be to learn horse. about He's dance, like music, theater, Harlem and to learn how to create and tell their own stories. And the idea was built on this, um, this notion of the village, of the African village, the notion of a community where everyone looks out for each other, uh, where everyone tries to reach, each one teach one, each one reach one, each one pull one to the sun. I'm encouraged with the young people in impact, which I see progressive change. There will be a triumph of the human spirit, and there will be, as the Black Panther Party would say, all power to all of the people.